There are two safe methods to end a pregnancy in the first weeks of gestation. On the one hand, the surgical procedure, and on the other hand, the medical one. The medical or pharmacological abortion is a safe procedure that can be performed until the ninth week of gestation. If you choose this method, you will have to take orally one or more tablets of a drug called Mifepristone. Mifepristone prevents pregnancy progression. After a period of 24 to 48 hours, another medication called misoprostol should be given. Its function is to expel the gestational sac from the uterus. Both drugs are necessary to interrupt the process of gestation. You should know that abortion with the medical method might take between a few hours and several days. Pills used in the medical abortion can only be delivered in hospitals and accredited centers for termination of pregnancy. During the process, you may experience the following symptoms and side effects. Heavy bleeding, heavier than ordinary menstruation, pain, nausea, vomiting, chills, diarrhea, fever. To ease these symptoms, you will be provided with painkillers. If you choose the medical abortion and decide to carry out the process at home and not in a medical center, you must be accompanied during the hours following the administration of misoprostol. This requirement is essential. You will have to go back to the accredited clinic to make sure the induced abortion has completed and the process is over. The medical abortion is successful in 95 to 97 percent of the cases. Surgical abortion. The other method available to end a pregnancy is the surgical abortion. This is a procedure involving dilatation and vacuum aspiration, which are not really surgical procedures, but rather instrumental ones. That is, to perform the abortion, medical professionals will use the natural openings of the body to empty the uterine contents without any incisions or cuts. This procedure can only be performed by professionals trained in this particular technical skill. The procedure takes place in a hospital or outpatient clinic and it can be performed up to week 15 of pregnancy or even week 17 in some cases. The surgical abortion is a fast and safe procedure. Firstly, a progressive dilation of the cervix is performed. Once the cervix has been dilated, the contents of the uterus are removed through vacuum aspiration. The surgical procedure can be performed under either local or general anesthesia or also with simple sedation, depending on medical advice and patient's preferences. This technique may last between 3 and 10 minutes. The side effects and symptoms of an instrumental abortion are bleeding and pain equal to or less than those experienced during your menstruation. In the case of surgical abortion, the rate of success is 98 to 100 percent. It's advisable to start using a contraceptive method on the same day of the abortion, when you resume your sexual relations or on the first days of the following menstruation. Which method to choose? When an abortion is performed by properly trained professionals, both methods are safe. The technique to be used, medical or surgical, will be determined by such factors as your medical situation, the number of weeks into your pregnancy, your physical and psychological condition, and your own personal situation. In other words, you and your own circumstances should decide which method to use, and no one else should decide for you.